Back here in the United States, the Indian Prime Minister's trip to the U.S. is bringing a new spark to relations between the two democracies. U.S. President Barack Obama and Narendra Modi talked about their shared vision for economic growth. The two leaders largely sidestepped some thornier issues, including nuclear energy and past diplomatic disputes. CCTV's Jessica Stone has more on Modi's visit to Washington. A shared history celebrated. In a departure from protocol, Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and U.S. President Barack Obama visited a memorial honoring the late Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. The U.S. civil rights leader gained inspiration from India's Mahatma Gandhi and his teachings of peaceful protest. Modi brought audio recordings of Dr. King's 1959 speech in India as a gift to Obama. Mr. Obama was going out of his way to say, let bygones be bygones and let's uh, rebuild and reestablish and deepen our ties further, that Mr. Modi wanted, to, he came prepared to actually reciprocate. The leaders have a lot to celebrate after a long partnership to stabilize Afghanistan. On Tuesday, the U.S. and Afghanistan signed a bilateral security agreement, leaving more than 12,000 troops to help smooth the nation's transition to its own leadership. Modi has called on the U.S. not to make a hasty troop withdrawal, as he says it did in Iraq. The Afghan people have shown the will to prevail over violence and extremism. We discussed our two countries' continued commitment to assist Afghanistan and our own coordination in this area. But the bulk of the prime minister's focus here in the United States is trying to beef up new interest from U.S. investors in the Indian economy. On Monday, he met with 11 American corporate leaders, earning praise from General Electric. Modi also invited U.S. investment management firm BlackRock to stage a major conference in India. Obama congratulated Modi on his efforts to roll back bureaucracy and make it easier to do business in India. The prime minister shared with me his vision for uh, lifting uh, what is still too many uh, Indians uh, who are locked in poverty into a situation in which their lives can improve. Modi and Obama also agreed to work towards resolving a dispute over India's blocking of an international trade agreement reached last year. India supports trade facilitation. However, I also expect that we are able to find a solution that takes care of our concern on food security. I believe that it should be possible to do that soon. The leaders also agreed to partner in areas like clean energy, climate change prevention, uh, and a new environmental campaign launched by Modi, which is called Clean India. We also learned that the U.S. Export-Import Bank has agreed to loan up to a billion dollars to India to purchase American-made renewable energy products. Jessica Stone, CCTV at the White House.